I've been watching. Um, I went back and watched all your your old fights, and it seems that, like the development. You started, uh, uh, let's say, martial arts around you know ages of eighteen, nineteen is when you really came into it. I, I read back that you actually started with karate in high school, yeah. and then kind of transitioned yeah. into MMA, which is why you have that karate stance. Yeah. But um, that transition of be much more calm and collected. We've really seen that over the past, I would say, four or five years from. I would one of the biggest turning points I watched was when you you lost to King Mo, but then you came back and you exhausted him and beat him by TKO. There was I noticed in that there was a very interesting transition. Yeah. Um, does that all play part with like your your school of thought and this type of you know um, um, uh, a Kaido way of life and this mentality and, and applying these this knowledge in these books from the Five Rings that you're putting into not just yourself personally but also um, exposing that into your martial art? Uh, I'm, I'm just searching for um, e everything, every, 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 every day and every hour, uh, every hour of skill, uh, or uh, uh, how to say. Uh, That's why we lost, bring the translator. Lo lo lost, <laughs> lost or, or whatever. Uh, it, it's... Th that have some meaning for for us, and that loss with um, uh, with King Mo for in first first fight with him uh, was for me so uh, so important because uh, I don't want to explain what what especially was that, but but <laughs> I started after after the loss, you know what you don't want and what you want. Yeah, and if you want that so much, then you change your life and and start to then you then you then you have the power to to change your life. Yeah, and I changed that. I changed many uh, habits from uh, from the training, and I started to be another another fighter, another man, and, and now I'm here. This mentality of what you want, but. Um, this way of thinking, this philosophy, this school of thought, uh, you also truly believe in living in the moment. Um, yeah. Do you look too far into the future or are you just kind of in your own moment? And, um, and then again, going back to you at Yoshiba, it's that, that thought of everything you know you already have. You, you don't need to look elsewhere for it. You already have that inside of you. And yeah. when, when, you're, when you're going into your, your career, are you looking that far into the future or is you it all focused on today? Yeah, no, no, no. You have to, you ha you have to look uh, inside yourself what, what inspires you. What inspires you? Where is, my, uh, where is my motivation? And that's, the, I think, the most, uh, most important thing because if, if you... If you you motivate if if motivate you something like uh, like money or or uh, or whatever that's the very weak uh, motivation and in the fight it will be n not enough uh, that you uh, that you can overcome the hard moments and all all these things yeah why why you will uh, will do the amazing thing in the cage that y you will do that because because and what? Because some motivation and and you have to know the answer for for this question, and I know that. And I <laughs> I, I, I wanna I wanna just show that, but I I have to keep it in the quiet in in, in myself inside. 